Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel or welcome to the channel if you're new here. In my last phone hunt I presented you my childhood friend, this box with the Sony Ericsson V630i inside and a uh, speaker dock or how do you call them? Well this is in Spanish, it's originally made for Spain. And uh, yeah. <laughs> I have a short story about this phone and why I bought it. It's because I had this phone back when I was in 8th grade. Yeah, I can't even remember how old I was, but... Um, it, this was my first phone with a 2 megapixel camera, which was above the VGA camera that I had on my Nokia 3220. And uh, an MP3 player. That's all I wanted from a phone. It's not a smartphone, it's not a Walkman phone even. It's a V, not a W, but uh, it did its job pretty well, and uh, I'm happy I had the chance to have it. And today I'm going to unbox it, show you what's inside a package like this, and I'm also going to do a review on it, so it's going to be a bit longer video, and also review the speakers. So let's jump right into it. And here we have it. So huge, this box. So on the front, we have, well, the phone presented with the speakers. The Sony Ericsson V630i and Altavoces, or I'm guessing speakers, MDS-60. This was uh, originally made for Spain. I also got it from Spain. Also, here's the link in the description and comment section with the eBay page from where I got it. Check it out. The seller has pretty awesome phones and new in the box. Worth looking. Now, let's look on the back. Well, it kind of it's explains the functions of the phone. MP3 player, 2 megapixel camera. It records 3GP videos. Oh man, 3GP. Yeah. 256 external memory card, which is included in the phone, Bluetooth and uh, quick access to music. Uh, you'll see about that. And these are the speakers. I, I wanted to get these types of speakers for a while and why not get it two in one? <laughs> Four or five watt speakers, nice. It, it uh, has a charger and these are the dimensions. 205 millimeter and 20 centimeters basically with with 13 centimeters and 30 centimeters with FM antenna included and also charges the phone at the same time September 2006 Vodafone Espania So let's open it up in this box Oops, sorry about that. In this box, we have two other boxes. <laughs> the music desk stand and the phone. I'll take them both out. I'm gonna review them both. Man, this, this desk stand is pretty heavy. Heavier than the phone. <laughs> now let me take the big boy out. Let me start with the desk stand first, and then we'll get to the phone. When I remember when I got it myself also from Vodafone, exactly the same box. <laughs> yeah. So, this is the box for the desk stand. Here we have the stand presented. Sony Ericsson Multimedia, yeah. Walkman, nice. A great presentation of how you can put it. Some information suitable for these phones made in China. But what isn't made in China? Neo Duo Magnus speaker units. So let's open it up. Here we should have the wall charger. Oh, what kind of charger is this? Well, since I'm going to review it, I'm going to take it out from the box. A 
adapter for MDS60. So that's all that it says here. Hmm. Long cable, <laughs> like it. Now for the desk stand. And that's kind of it, huh? Oh, warranties and stuff like that. Yeah. Let me take this out of the way. I'm wearing gloves to not scratch it. This is how it looks closed. <laughs> the on off switch, the charging port. Don't tell me you can also work with batteries. Haha, <sighs> no way. Four AA batteries. Nice. Because it's portable, you know? So. Here is the connector for it. Oh, and this is removable. You can put it like this. Okay. Oh, and like this. And it should click in. Oops, easy. And it clicked in place. Nice. <laughs> Look at all these chickens. So, by the way, I understood it should has built-in antenna. Yeah, I do have to write some songs into it. I'm gonna put the connector in and pull some of the cable out so that it will reach my desk here okay it should be in the center of the video good let me put this aside for now and i do remember putting some music in my w995 i take the memory card out i'll put it in this phone to put some music in now Let's unbox the little beast. Well, nothing too interesting on this phone because it's Vodafone packaged. It only says Vodafone in the phone model and that's it. Vibrant black. So first off, we have the quick guide, which is sealed and is going to remain sealed. The PC Suite CD. This in the CD, it's also red from Vodafone, yeah. And some information, warranties and SAR information. That's kind of it. Underneath this, I put all this back. Underneath all this, we have the phone and look at how long this data cable is. <laughs> exactly how I remember even the smell it has a specific plastic cardboard smell ah oh, nostalgia I just realized that this card is an 8 gigabytes one I hope it can read it so that's the data cable this is the battery I don't know if it's charged if it's not I will charge it later but use one of mine this is the battery BST 37 here we have the headphones, it's exactly the headphones that mine had. The charging brick. Actually let me shed some extra light here. Okay, I think it's better now. Here we have the battery cover. I'm gonna very carefully put in. Let me. The light is too close. There we go. I hope it's not too bright. 
how cool the battery cover looks. Well, yeah, the, I remember mine as well. It has the Vodafone logo and not the Sun Ericsson logo, but what can you do? It's made for Vodafone. And nothing else in the box. Here we have the phone itself. This is exactly how it should supposed to came. Protective screen over the display, protective screen over the camera. My god, how beautiful it is. Oh, memories. Let me put a SIM card in it. Where, where, there it is. Let's start. Oh my god, it immediately started. Look how nice the chrome looks on the button. This is very easy to scratch. Even the receive and end call. Beautiful. Let me try to put the... Kind of hard to put it in. That didn't sound right. Try to do something here. That's kind of it. I'm not gonna completely take that out. Should click in place. There it is. And like I said, it's in a big box that it has a quick access to music. This is the button for that for the music player. Continued. Yes. <laughs> Take this out of the way. Let me tell you this. <laughs> also, some sort of always on display like Nokia. <laughs> As specification, this phone was announced and produced in May 2006. That was some. It uh, uses normal SIM, mini SIM actually. The display is a 1.9 inch, uh, 220 by 176 pixels. It has wallpaper, screensavers. This is the typical Vodafone wallpaper. Ah, so nice. It looks so nice. So, the me and unfortunately, I just found out the memory card. It's only accepting 2 gigabytes maximum. So, I'll have to send some music to this, like in the old days. <laughs> it has a, well, loudspeaker. It doesn't have a 3.5 millimeter audio jack, but you can buy a cable with adapter for it. Uh, Bluetooth is 2.0 uh, and USB 2.0. No radio, no wireless. What? Yeah, it's a mid phone, not a, it's not a smartphone. It's a normal dumb phone, but with good personality. <laughs> I I don't. It's just awesome. Two megapixel camera and records 3GP. Let's enter the camera. Pressing the button. Press once and it gets in. Exactly how I remember it. Oh my god, 300 plus megapixel photos with 2 megapixel. Video camera. High quality video selected. Yeah. <laughs> Save to reset, white balance, turn off, shoot mode. Oh, you can just set by like this. <laughs> yeah. Now, let me do something about this thing. So I got here this one back to put the memory card back in. Yeah, what the freak? There you go. And I need to look for the battery for it. Be right back. Also, to put a SIM card in like this. Try to be extra careful not to drop it on this beauty. I mean, in terms of advancements, this one it's advanced, more advanced than it, but that's the one that I had. I'm proud of it. There you go. 
and it turns on this is how you can use the front facing camera which is a VGA one only like this you can't actually take pictures with it or something like that but really and I remember this thing I don't like the sound This is the sound. This is the sound that I liked. Oh, and if you press the volume, you can see the information. The model, memory, and the battery. 33%. Well, let me go to toolbar. This is main shortcut, Bluetooth. Turn on. Also, visibility, show phone, good. I want this for menu. Bluetooth on. No. Okay, it works. File, send via Bluetooth. This is how you send back in the day. Select, connecting, I accept. And while it's transferring, I can't actually use them. No, I think I can get this one back and use it, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna let it to transfer in peace. Wow, seven megabytes and 81, 860 kilobytes. One megabyte is done out of almost eight. So I'll be right back when it's almost done. Well, I'm back, let's see. Save the music on memory stick, use now, oh yeah. Okay, let's go to the music player. can kind of see what I'm doing. This is the, uh, the audio quality of it. Before I connect to the speaker, I forgot to tell you this. So, this is the front facing camera, the earpiece, the display, the buttons, you kind of guess that. The connecting, uh, well, the daytime charging port, the microphone, here you can put a strap, wrist strap, camera button, volume up and down button, power button, the status LED, the status LED indicator. This is to connect to some accessories, I believe. The play and stop music. On the back, we have the two megapixel camera, the mirror, the loudspeaker. I like that it's made to look like three, but actually here is where the loudspeaker is. This this whole thing is just a sticker with that form factor. And here it should be the logo and the model, but this one is Vodafone branded, so yeah. Let me take this one out. Send, thank you. Just so I don't forget, I will turn the Bluetooth off. 
also the phone will turn off and and this one as well see this is the 3g logo and the bluetooth bluetooth turn off the battery is kind of dying 27 so i'll have to charge it quick and put this back to not for, to be done with it you know okay let me get these out of the way put these speakers right here Well, I can hear that charger <laughs> working. Oh yeah, I forgot to turn it on. <laughs> Here's the button. Optimize charging, nice. Let's start the music again. Yeah, it's not connecting properly, properly for now. Right, so apparently it's a problem with the charger here. Well, it's to be expected, it's old. It stayed like this for all these years, from 2006 to now. So I've put in batteries. I'm not going to put the battery cover on, but I'm going to put this one. And now, play baby, play. I would say that it sounds pretty awesome, like 4 or 5 watts, 20 watts speaker, come on, that's too awesome. Let me adjust the... Rewinding a little to the interesting part. I would say it's pretty loud, <laughs> like pretty loud. So here's the problem with this thing. Let me take the batteries out. Let me turn it off first. It just comes out like this. I didn't have, I didn't have too many batteries, so I used what I could. But it's a pretty smart thing to put uh, batteries on it. That's why you make it portable. And you don't have to wait to charge it. You can just buy other batteries and that's it. Fast recharge. Now that's what I call a fast recharge. I'm going to put this again here. And try again. But... I mean, when it's plugged in, it also charges the phone. But here's the problem if it works. Nothing happens, eh? And it's on. Like. It keeps doing this. Optimize charging. It's 
kind of annoying. Yeah. Well, anyway, I only cared mostly for the phone. But the speakers are also awesome. <laughs> so let me actually make a thumbnail for it. I'm just going to put it like so. Thumbnail, baby. Should be thumbnail like this. So thank you very much for watching. Well, if you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like. Maybe consider subscribing. And what are your thoughts about this phone? Do you have it back then? Do you have it now in your collection? I, for one, missed it and uh, almost shed a tear, <laughs> honestly, because this, like I said, this was the phone that opened the uh, MP3s player and uh, good cameras for me as a teenager. I mean, yeah, I know, I, back then we didn't have the term uh, dumb phone or smartphone, I mean, yeah, smartphone existed, but, uh, I, dang, I, I didn't even knew these things had processors and RAM memories in it, <laughs> I didn't consider them as being as a computer, you know, but it does its job pretty well. Also, let me look at other teams. As entertainment, we have music, DJ, photo, DJ, TV. I never used the TV because I didn't know how to. Teams. What other teams do we have? Oh, this one has something more. Yeah, set. What's this? The VTA. I don't know this. Oh, okay. VTA tour. Interesting. Fashion. Louise. Vodafone Live is the standard and I'm going to keep it like that. Yeah, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go charge this phone with its charger that works. <laughs> And then I'll put it back in the box. Anyway, that's for my story. Also, one more thing. I also I also managed to find my uh, phone pouch, to say like that. When I was in high school, I had this phone. Then I bought the N73. The only problem is the N73 was locked in orange. And this one was locked on Vodafone. So I had them both, orange and Vodafone. <laughs> this was my main phone basically and this was more mostly for the internet because it was a bit faster but yeah so the, my my classmates uh, nicknamed me businessman because I had the N73 and this little pouch here I'm surprised it survived which I put to my belt and this was in the <laughs> in my pocket both on the right side and on the left side I had my wallet and I also had played the Worms with my friends. I mean, I installed the Worms in both my Nokia and Sony Ericsson and could play multi multiplayer with uh, by Bluetooth, you know? And uh, it was pretty awesome to do that <laughs> during class when it was boring. Yeah, that is the only cool part. And anyway, too much backstory. I'm feeling very nostalgic. This phone... I'm gonna proudly put this phone in my collection. So I have again. I relived a bit of my childhood, childhood, teenage years. You know, the good part of it. Yeah. Man, nostalgia really hits you hard when it hits you. Yeah. Sorry. Be become emotional. <laughs> so I wish you a very awesome day, just like yourself, and all the best. And I hope if you are collecting phones, that you have very awesome finds, very awesome phones. 
and to have a collection to be proud of. Well, all the best. Bye.